You know the good girls who don't come outside and get cheated on? Do you know that? Yeah! Ava, I'm about to cry! Ava, I'm about to cry! No money on your card. Y'all, he done hit the nigga car trying to get an Instagram. <gasps> Denim! Why the fuck are you peeking around the corner? Don't fall, please, don't fall, please. Did it on the first try and it's not crooked either. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. <laughs> Don't play with me. I want to be mad at me. Valet Park is on the district. I want straight to gallery. Just feeling y'all. I just gotta see it though. If you had a twin, I would still choose you. I don't want to rush into it if it's too soon, but I know. What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Eva Galore, and I'm back again with another video. This one, drum roll, Beauty Kini. Beauty Kini. Uh, Beauty Kini. I think it's Beauty Kini. Please let it be Beauty Kini. Y'all know me. Bad with names. I think it's Beauty Kini. I think I said it right. They sent me three of their products, y'all. Let's get into it, okay? Beauty Kini is a female friendly company that tends to create revolutionary period swimwear and period underwear that truly revolutionize menstrual experience for all women. We have some swimwear bottoms, some high waisted heavy flow period underwear. Then we have the beauty lace period underwear. So it's like, we'll still be cute on your period. I think it's like some lace and look cute lace. I'm gonna show you. So, I really wish I could see. Hold on, there we go. You gotta see the difference in texture. That whole little part, this whole little part. And they're really cute and I'm gonna show you with them on. Bomb, all right. That is cute for it to be pure pennies. Usually pure pennies be a little ugly, but that's, that's cute. That was the lace one. It has a built-in leak-proof function. The combination of absorbent and leak-proof layers make you feel dry and confident with the absorption capacity of eight tampons. It can provide full protection whether you are exercising during the day or lying flat at night. It's a leak-proof design. Environmental protection. Easy clean and care. All you gotta do is throw them in the washing machine. Okay? And that goes for all the pennies that you're about to see. So I'm gonna try on this one for y'all. I'm gonna have a little penny haul, you know. Thank this company, cause y'all will never see me in my panties for free. This one, I think this one is just the high waisted heavy flow period underwear. It has the part, you see the difference in texture? It got your back. You got back up right here. Leak proof y'all, remember that. All of that, friend, can you look at the back of my butt? Can you see, is there anything on the back of my butt? Is there anything on the back of my butt? Take a picture of my butt, can you see anything? I'm gonna walk in front of you. Cause that was my struggle in high school, honey. In high school, I was the queen of, can you look and see if anything is gonna make out I can't. You know, all of that scarce, that was trauma, okay? They are curing trauma. They are making trauma less of a thing for high school girls, middle school girls. I like how it's the panties. Like when I'm on my period, I like the panties to hug my body, so my pad and nothing will be too loose on my body and no blood slip out at all. I like my stuff to be up so I can feel secure down there. Let me see ya. And then for the last pair, we have the high waisted period swimwear bottoms. Once again, it has that different texture in the middle, the leak proof, 
built-in leak protection to keep you secure at all times absorbs up to three tampons. The menstrual bathing suit can hold the liquid of three tampons when menstruation is heavy. Disposal sanitary products can be used for extra protection. Enjoy the beach, the pool, or the lake without worrying about your period. Ooh, let me show you how these as well. Yeah. So, I only got three products. So, those were the three. Swimwear, the regular high waist, and the lace. It's giving Victoria's Secret. The lace is my favorite. I like these, so. The current promotional activities of Beauty Kimi. The first one is the Beauty Kimi period underwear. First order, three sizes. If your first order is a specific size, they will generously offer you one size up and one size down with your purchase. If you have any other size preferences, please specify them in the order notes. Two, period underwear subscriptions. So these are the subscription benefits. Initial purchase includes buy one, get two, extra free plus an extra 20% off. Enjoy a 20% off discount on each $26.99 item billed periodically every month. Visit the website on the screen and use my code ABLE10 to get money off your purchase. All the details that you need to know about this product will be linked in the description box. Anything you need to know about this company, the website, the direct links, everything will be in the description box. You, can, you guys can go down there and check it out before you leave. Because I got a lot of girl subscribers, a lot of girls. Y'all, I got you. Ava got your back. I got y'all back. Okay, I got your back. And I'm here for you, okay? I know how hard it could get. I know how scary it could get. Everybody got high school trauma from them little period moments, but it's okay. We healing, you know what I'm saying? So, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you click down in the description box before leaving to get you a pair. Okay, you won't regret it, girl. Bye. Ooh. Y'all see them piles of clothes back there? What's up, YouTube? It's your girl Ava back again with another we can go up. Mm hmm Yeah. My arm is tired already from holding the camera on. Come run with me. We're about to run somewhere real quick. I'm about to give me some food. I want to go get some food now. I'm so fucking hungry, but I think I'm going to do it. On my way back home, I want some Whataburger. I was on TikTok and I came across something about a patty meal. Yeah. But anyway, back to the store because I want to get my friend a gift that I'm going to see tonight. She just moved to Houston. I'll to explain all this type of stuff later. But I just wanted to come on and say, what's up, you know? Oh, what's up, bitch? Ignore all those clothes out there. I got to follow them. You should be looking here. You should be looking here. Let's head out. To the store. And then we're gonna get some food yeah, later on tonight. I gotta come back home so I can get in the shower, do my hair, cause I'm going out. Ava is going out. Y'all know I don't go out then since I've been in Houston. Houston is just it's not set up for me to go out. It don't give go out because I don't be happy to go out with. Like I got people to go out. With. Like I don't know, I'm making friends and shit, but like I don't know, it don't be giving go out. But yeah, more story, I don't go out all then. Even though this is definitely the city to turn up, I just don't. But my friend, she just moved to Houston like last week or something like that, so we outside now. We celebrating now. About to go to the store to get her a gift. So come on. Yeah, to stop and get gas. Yeah, I know the drip, girl. I don't never got gas. Ooh, my car is so dirty. Hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I'm going to Walmart to get my friend gift like a housewarming gift like a welcome to houston type of gift shout out to shay chanel i think that's a youtube name as well on here shay chanel she moved here 
And I'm just about to get her a little Welcome to Houston baggy. She should not be a small YouTuber, but you know it is what it is. I'm just showing my appreciation because she's been supporting me. Like, she supports the fuck out of me. We've been supporting each other. She is gang. Like, and she just moved here? Like, what? Like, what? But we're meeting up tonight to go out. And it's just, we just gonna celebrate. We're gonna have a time tonight. Because we deserve a time. You know what I'm saying? We work hard. I'm starving. It's about to be probably 3 o'clock. And I haven't ate nothing all day. There's so many people at the damn store. What the hell is going on? Okay, this is what I found. Okay. That's what I'm gonna get her. We're about to leave now. I'm the greatest friend on earth. I know, trust me, I know, I know, I know. Welcome to Water Burger. My name is Teresa. Take a few minutes looking at that menu whenever you're ready for all the way forward and that right Thank you. Oh, okay. She's good. <laughs> I'm slow, Olivia. Can you give me the name for the order? Um, Ava. Hi, welcome to Water My name is Teresa. Um, they ain't put a little, they ain't put enough sugar in. Thank you. Me too. Woo! Mm. I saw everybody on TikTok like, don't pay the meals, don't pay the meals, don't pay the meals. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go get me one. I'm scared. Ooh, it look all right. So I'm gonna make my friend bag real quick because I forget, I walk out here and forget all of this shit. So this is her little candle that I got her. It smells so good. I wanted to buy one for myself. They was on like $5 at Walmart. It smells so good. So I went with red and pink, and then I got this pink tissue paper. <laughs> so let me get her champagne. And then this is her little champagne. This is some good champagne, like especially if you got some mimosas. What are you doing? Yeah, ignore my background. I gotta do my hair and it's seven o'clock. Wait, what time is it? It's gonna be seven o'clock. I gotta leave at 10 and I gotta put a wig on, do my makeup, put some clothes on, take some pictures, all this type of stuff. So let me get started. And let me charge my phone. This is what I'm wearing over here and it's the fact that I got my wig sitting over here as if it's part of the outfit. Anyways, I need this. I'm gonna hang it up here like a coat. Mm-hmm. Y'all know I don't know how to do no cornrows, so I'm gonna try to do this wig on with um my hair just down. Dude, get out of here chewing like a damn cow. You could have finished eating in the living room. Okay, we just gonna slick it back, put it in a little bun, slap the wig on the wig is originally a glue wig, but I'm gonna try to put some glue on it. Yeah, I'm gonna try to put some glue on it because I want it to be secure. The club is just too risky to go with a glueless wig on because ain't no telling. A bitch might play with me at the club and I'm not gonna have no wig flying. Flying all on the DJ booth because I got a glueless wig on. Absolutely fucking not. Yeah, I think we could finesse a, a flat against the wall. Hold on, let me close up my robe. Let me see if I can work my magic. Let me see. Let me, let me, damn, this thing tight. <laughs> 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 Bitch, I bought for real. I look like my ex mama. I am bald as fuck right now. You know, good girls who don't come outside get cheated on. <laughs> I look like with a wig. I look weird. 
I gotta bring this hair back to life. It's been balled up in a goddamn bin for months. If y'all could see this goddamn vanity right now. Oh my God. And all I did was my hair. It's gonna get worse when I pull out my makeup stuff. <laughs> you know, I'm probably gonna come back with my hair done. Cause I'm gonna, I'm gonna be flat ironing for like the next 35 minutes. You my brother, the that. Where my music, huh? You know, good girls who don't come outside just heat it on. But I'm sweating so bad in here. <sighs> I think I'm gonna have to finish doing my makeup butt ass naked because I gotta take this hot ass robe off. I think it's this hot comb. That's the motherfucking problem. Let you buy what you want. Hmm. Yeah, but damn, I want all three. I should be done with makeup by like 10 o'clock. Yeah, I'm gonna be done with makeup by like 10. And then I'm gonna leave out the house at 10.30. And I should make it downtown by 11. My camera's going to yet. Let me fix that. Denim is in my bed sleep like he my nigga or something. What the fuck? Do you pay bills? You do? Which one? Light bill? Okay, my bad. <laughs> I forgot you pay that. I'm tripping. What eye look do I want to do? Brown, duh. Hi! So my makeup is done. And I don't have no more needs. I don't have no more. <laughs> You know, good girls who don't come outside get cheated on. I just gotta keep reminding y'all that that's why I'm going outside. <laughs> but anyways, hot as fuck. And my whole personality just changed because now I'm all ready. So now my Nicki Minaj alter ego, high heels. Okay. I'm about to put my clothes on. I was a little iffy about this outfit, but I think it's gonna come together once now that my hair and makeup is done. You know how that be. And I got 30 minutes to like, you know, take some pictures and I really be getting dolled up these days. So, you know, gotta get all day in. I just bust out of the fucking, y'all see that? <laughs> I didn't know my back was so wide. Oh my God, okay. Um, Now I gotta cut the damn. That was embarrassing. All I did was put my arms down and she said, boom. <laughs> so I be calling y'all big backs and that was a big back ass moment. Oh my goodness. My wide ass back just broke the fucking dress. Okay then. Okay, this thing is too little. I don't know what's going on. I need to make sure I pack my lip liner. My Cormac. My wallet. Oh shit, my purse went backwards. You know the good girls who don't come outside get cheated on? Do you know that? Okay, just making sure. This is the look. I don't feel like showing y'all the bottom half. I'm about to take some pictures. No bar. Come on, bye bye. I don't want to forget her thing. Come on, come on. Cage, cage, cage. I'm running late. Y'all, it's 11 o'clock, and I said I was going to be there at 11. Well, that's the time we agreed on. And the place 30 minutes away from me. I am terrible. I'm Who the fuck calling me? I did. You did not give me a gift. It's a welcome to Houston gift. Hold on. <laughs> And I'm about to Oh my god, you look you like pretty! You did too! Y'all 
gonna get the chicken. She said she a boy and a girl and a boy and a girl. No, the fuck I did not tell her. Yes, you did. You said your mom was confused as a gender reveal. That's what the fuck what I told her. She asked me if I'm a girl or boy. Hey, boy. We're going to Connecticut next week. Do I gotta buy your ticket? You no, you ain't gotta buy my ticket. You need to move on my way. I got the room and everything. You wanna go to Bad Habits or no? Yeah. Come on. Bitch, don't you gonna put your phone up on the body? Yeah. Alright, y'all. So we was literally <laughs> getting our face. shots. He's talking about. He was like, "Where y'all going after this?" I was like, "I'll let y'all know, right?" He's talking about, I was like, where are you going? He's talking about, I'm going with y'all. It's a two-man. No, <laughs> no, the fuck is not. No, the fuck is not a two-man. I was like, oh, for real? That was a Chanel because it could have been, the night could have been, we could have been smoking our cars. No, for real. We have so, to. the night is free. Okay, so shout out to Chanel. Shame. But, the niggas got a section deal with a bottle. <laughs> Nigga, go home. He talk, he said, I don't want to order a bottle because I don't want everybody putting their mouth on me. <laughs> Ain't you fuck with everybody in the section? Why would you get a whole section if you don't fuck with everybody in the section and you let people in your section tomorrow? I don't want, I don't want everybody to That PVV loan ran the fuck out! Girl, and then my thing is, they was the rich niggas with money. Why y'all ain't trying to order a bottle? Going to get. <laughs> y'all, we fooled. She just fucking. <laughs> y'all, we fooled up. These niggas had no bottles. <laughs> Just a section. They kept getting us shots the whole night. They was like, let me know when y'all want a shot. Let me know y'all want something. What some. is the fuck? Nigga, I don't know what you doing to my drink, actually. I, I swear fuck. to God, when he run the drink over there, I, I was, was looking like, mm. for bubbles. I no, was dead bubbles. ass. I was looking at the bottom of the drink. All right, this look just like liquor. I swear to God. I was it's looking liquor. for bubbles. It's you really... <laughs> no money or your card. Here, 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 here. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga, the DJ, well, I don't think he's DJ. The nigga that bought us, like, up to every y'all and y'all. She ain't trying to go to my bed. Yeah, yeah, I'm putting it in my maps right now. He's talking about some. For a few minutes away. Let me know if y'all want some shots. Boy, eat dick. Bye. No. Actually, let me know when you ready to buy a Oh, April. <laughs> y'all, why the fuck April finna run into the gate? Her ass drove. Don't tell my fucking her, business. Her ass drove straight ahead, y'all. <laughs> Y'all, he done hit the nigga car trying to get an Instagram. Shadil just called for accident. <laughs> no fucking way. He just hit his car. You got a wife? Ooh. You so cute. You ain't just cute. You getting money too. You finna trick off who? <laughs> Go, cause they finna cuss you out, boy. Bye. Go. Can I get a patty? Oh, they got wings. They got boneless wings. Oh, yeah, this is my second time having this. Hello. Corset. Corset. Loosen the corset. Y'all, the corset needs to be loosened, honey. Y'all, tonight was so funny. We done caused the accident. We done seen finesse two times with the little kid. You know that That shit was so ghetto, but I enjoyed myself. I did. No, he could have he could have stirred it with his finger, licked it, and then passed out. <laughs> you know that bitch. Damn, I taste it. Ah, I'm black, child. This motherfucker been black. We What's so toxic. Doing? Okay, that's fine, bitch. I'm from the DM, yo, dumb ass. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, just the nine three. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, boy. That's that motherfucker. <laughs> I say Houston's so full of BBL. BBL just everywhere. Y'all, it was the BBL. Not the BBL, the BBL. That's why you going to club with sunglasses, because I'm tired. Wait, where your sunglasses at? I, girl, don't ask Mom, me. right here. This is my order. Y'all want to go rain? Okay. Oh, it's a yoga bag. A boomerang or a mukbang? I mean, a mukbang. Mm -hmm. Y'all, Ava dropped the fucking fry. <laughs> a mukbang, I'm sorry. <laughs> She's talking about y'all want a boomerang. Damn this shit hot. Yeah, this glass is gonna come outside. You know? Wow, no, this is my second payment of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, guys. See you later.
Anyway, uh, she's hoe up. Scoob is hoe up. Be safe, girl. Bye, girl. Bye, bye. Ooh. A time was had. But y'all, I forgot I had a patty milk. Ah! I forgot about my patty milk, y'all. Let me figure out what happened yesterday. Y'all know me and uh me and uh <laughs> me and Shay stopped at uh Whataburger. And when I I was eating my food and then I had ended up calling my ex and he made me lose my appetite. <laughs> He made me lose my appetite. <laughs> so I did finish the patty milk, but that's okay because I'm gonna eat it right here. I'm finna tear this patty milk up. Hey, we young for fucking nigga shit. You don't let this nigga be. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm happy I thought about my patty milk. I'm like, oh shit! My patty milk! Get your ass off that trash can. Oh, this lighting is ugly in here. What's up, guys? Oh, I'm at work. On the phone with my mother. I hope don't nobody walk in here with this camera out because I don't want to. Why you know I do use a. Mm mm. I like to keep that a secret, babe. I've been in here making TikToks because I'm bored. It's 4 30 and I don't get off to 11 weird I broke my nail I'm not in the mood I probably got to scrape the um frost off my car Texas is ghetto and I didn't sign up for this shit I came here for 70 degree weather in January and it's fucking 20 and I don't appreciate it because I didn't sign up for this I signed up for the vibe. This is not vibe. This is ghetto and it's reminding me of St. Louis. But I'm off of work. It's like 11 o'clock at night. One thing about a bad bitch, we're gonna get a check. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look at this ghetto shit. And y'all, my coworker, she rides a motorcycle to work every day. Did y'all just see all of that frost on my car? She drives a motorcycle. She drove it today, y'all. And that's why we leave at work kind of early because she has to get home. And it's late at night and she lives like 30, 40 minutes away on a motorcycle. She's finna get on the highway with that thing, which means the, the air finna smack her in her face. That way I got me some snacks. I got me some weenies. Because number one, that pond smell like a big bag of bounce that ass. <sighs> After work, it will be tired. But y'all, let me tell y'all something that I've been on lately. Like I've been on. Like as soon as I get to work, I be looking forward to it. Cause y'all know I work on my feet now. And I got a new job and stuff like that. Mount Rack since your girl foot massage. They sent me some help. I have the FM002 model. I have it in black. And we're gonna unbox it and get into it. And this is the company's website and Facebook and social media and stuff like that. And plus it's in the description box, which you should be looking near anyway before this is over with. But anyway, let's unbox it. So you don't need to build anything, okay? Everything comes together. Um, this is the plug-in part. You have to plug this into the machine, then plug it into the wall. Then we got some instructions. And then we have the remote. So you don't have to like bend down and change the settings and stuff like that. So this is the part you plug into the wall. And then we have power, kneading, air compression, heat, and a timer, which is 15 and 30 minutes. I always do the 30 because I get down, I don't play. So yeah, this is me just basically, you got it feels so good. Like words can't even explain. And then putting it up away, the storage is simple. Just put it away if they're anywhere, okay? So Y'all check out the description box before y'all leave, okay? Thank you to my Rex. If I have a code, I will link it below. All right, get back into the vlog, y'all. Bye bye. Oh, 
trying to keep it together, but I'm falling apart. And I'm my enemy, throwing things, crying, trying to figure out where the hell I went wrong. Baba, how do you feel about you about to get a bath? Like, are you upset? Like... Bingo, I was trying to eat cherry tomato. Pickle at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck! No, honey. It wasn't a morning time, but you eat some alfalfa. It'll stop you getting sick. Yeah, you better get the bathtub before we go to the grocery store. Ah, yeah! 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 Oh, shit, it's hot. Get over here. Dinner. Yeah. 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 Come on. y'all oh <gasps> denim why the fuck are you peeking around the corner this shit ain't even funny like this shit is dead ass not fucking funny get your ass out my way i need a whole new comforter we going to the shelter put your shoes on because i'm done i can't fuck with them no more no more. I'm back to normal. I'm not mad anymore. Every week we vlog. Y'all should know this by now. I cook one meal for the week. That's just that. So we're gonna go make stuffed peppers today. I think it's easy, baby mama hunter, y'all. Um yeah, we're gonna go make the stuff bell peppers. I'm gonna look it up on TikTok. And then, yeah, we're gonna get the ingredients from HEB that's where we're going right now. I really wanted a seafood boil today, but I'm like, let me create this content for the goddamn vlog. I'm trying to get my uh, my my skills up, because God said he gonna send me a man, something like that. He said something like that. Yeah, this man is up in here barking like he lost his mind. We finna go. Cause you crazy. Get your ass back. Get your ass back. How did you guys get right here? Then I'm just shitting in the hallway. So I gotta go out there and go get that up. Why don't you shit in the hallway? Sorry. No time for locking your phone and not coming home and starting some shit when I'm gonna do You acting kinda shady. Oh shit. <laughs> Wait, I wanna keep the lids. This one just fell off with the This boy just got in the trash can. He just got these uh cores. He been doing too much all day today. I'm trying to get him in training. Like I'm gonna find somewhere out here close to my house that trains dogs. And I'm gonna send him away for six weeks because he don't listen to me. He do what the fuck he wanna do. So I'm trying to find some professional help because I can't do it. I don't know how this gonna work, but they said put them in here. I don't know. 
So I'm gonna just do what the TikTok said. Uh, and then I add, you can either add a whole onion or This part ain't make sense to me. We put in peppers inside of peppers. Like, huh? Me. Wait, I forgot how you do this. I might have put it in the microwave. Place water and rice, put it in the microwave on high. I ain't got time to do this on the stove, so I'm gonna just do this in the microwave. Mm It's not instanting. Like, why is it take long? Word to my mother. The lady, the the lady on the TikTok, she said, "You um, at the at my rice, I gotta put in sugar." So, don't, you know? She said this needs sugar. She said just a little bit though. So when you see it, be quiet. That's, I just wanted to, you know, TW. Trigger warning, you know, for the anti-sugar people. So don't pull out your nine. Okay. This rice taking all day. I'm about to get activated. You know I can't see nothing wrong. Add some cheese, add some meat, add some cheese, add some meat, cause I like a lot of cheese. Mm -mm. Oh shit, <laughs> damn. Y'all, all this shit just fell out. Go back in there. Put them in the oven or a couple minutes. We got some extra. Let's go. You want some? I don't know. Mm. I'm gonna say this one. You want some? Oh, y'all see that? Mmm. Yeah, I ain't put a lot though. These peppers is fine. Oh, girl. Mmm. -hmm. He had some ground beef, so he needs to stop hopping. Let the church say amen. Woo. God, I've been up here trying to do this TikTok dance. And I think I got it. Okay, y'all wanna see? That's a movie, you gotta fuck that up. Do it, right? Do it, slip. Do it, slip. Do it, right? Do it. Yeah, boo. Yeah, I've been up here practicing for about five minutes. No, I practiced for like 15. Cause I kept fucking up. I'm about to learn another one. <laughs> God, but I got work in the morning. Pretty pissed off about that. I've been fucking these Snickers up. I had a whole bag of them. I'm about to give dinner one. <laughs> Bye. Chanel bag off the Chanel swag. I swear I'm feeling you. And I'm in my panties, so if you see a little cooch and a little butt, y'all already know the drill. Happy birthday. Don't ever say I never did nothing for you. I just got off work and the last thing I want to do is come home and put on a wig, but 
money is calling me and i have to pick up the phone i'm my granny call me i need to call my granny back real quick i'm gonna talk to y'all i put this week on because i ain't really been picking up the camera all this week and i gotta get out of my vlog i went to work looking just like this because i woke up at 7 30. no i woke up at seven o'clock and i supposed to be at work at seven i looked out that window i saw the sun was coming up i'm like what the fuck my alarm didn't go off because my phone was turned off let me go get this wig because i'm really scared about this wig hold on y'all Oh, Granny, walk with me. What is you doing, Graham? You could go bust down middle part of the side. You could go by. Or you can go. You can go by. Or you can go blind. Go blind. You can go blind. I'm like, I'm about to do my hair. Oh, he did walking around. He was. You could go. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell y'all what happened to me at work yesterday. Story time. So I'm in motherfucker work. The door slammed real, real, real hard. I'm bringing the equipment out the soil room. I'm using my foot as a door stopper because I'm in and out. So I got my foot as a door stopper because. I'm trying to keep the TV at the door open so I won't have to put the passcode in. But my hand is on the doorway. What do you call that shit? Oh, this is just crazy. I guess I was moving too fast because this is not even like me. I guess I my foot, I stopped using my foot as a door stopper, but my hand was still rested on the fucking doorway. And that door, next thing I know, that door almost took my shit off it almost took my bones was in fucking distress bitch that job owed me a fucking raise for that pain that i went through i really want to take the band-aid off and show y'all the skin is split it's bleeding um and i have a blood clot and this finger was swollen it really was all three of these fingers they got clothes in it but it was just this finger that got it the worst I ran my finger up under some cold water. That wasn't doing it. Then it was bleeding. It then it started getting a heartbeat. It was at the end of my shift. I was ready to fucking go. I couldn't even work these fingers for the rest of my shift, y'all. I'm at work always doing something to myself. Like I'm just a big ass kid. I'm always running my foot over. I'm hitting my foot. I'm dropping something. I'm smashing my fingers through the drawer. I'm breaking my nails. Like. I don't know what it is with this job. Anyway. I gotta, mm -mm, I gotta shit. I'm sorry. Bye, y'all. That was a TMI. I don't care. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. It's a big booty. A big booty. I ain't want no nice house. A bad mood, bitch. Honestly, I'm not even in the mood. I'm not even gonna act like I am. I'm not. I'm not. When I start bringing this out, life is fucking me. But that's okay. I'm a freak. I put back. And do y'all care to know about my day? I'm gonna tell you anyway. <sighs> Today, Get out my face, then, please. Mm, mm, mm. I've been away from my baby too long. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Okay, I'm gonna put you down, okay? Yes, you gotta get down. 
Yes, you gotta get down, Papa. You gotta get down. <laughs> oh my God, you're such a big baby. Siri, play Nikki because honestly, after today, all I do is all I wanna hear. A big booty bitch, a big booty bitch. He don't want no names out. A bad money bitch. Yeah, then I'm saying it's the big booty bitch. <laughs> Say you don't want no nice pop. A bad moody bitch. What is your problem? Can you stop? What JT say? I'm PMS to stay the fuck out my way. I think that's the problem. I think I'm gonna start my period. I think that's what it is, guys. Then I'm gonna PMS to stay the fuck out my way. Oh, we gotta put your leash on. Hold on. Then, um, what you want? Tell her what you want. Uh, many seconds, I'll get it. I put ketchup and honey mustard. Here. This Tell her what you want. But it's my fucking ninth time getting a fucking biggie bag. I need to leave these biggie bags the fuck alone. Hold on, do I got my wallet? Then you gonna be paying. Thank you. Uh, no, come up here. Get back. Oh, thank you. Cup dinner. Stop playing. A bad move. Stop. Thank you. You too. Dinner. I'm gonna give you five more seconds to back the fuck up off my bag. I'm gonna turn you into a biggie bag. You don't back the fuck up. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> Amazing, isn't it amazing? Blazing. Nikki make me so happy. Ah, I feel so much better. Okay, come on. Hey, boo. I'm watching a Tootsie movie. No way he kept a couple. It is so ghetto, but I like it. You know, it's two things I ain't never played about. Yeah. Stop licking your lips. It's like super duper late at night. I'm finally doing that weird collab that I've been putting off since what? Fucking Thursday, Friday. I'm finally doing it. Please give me a round of a fucking applause in the comments, please. Because it's really just took everything in me. But I finally had to do it because I go back to work tomorrow. And I can't push it off anymore. I go back to work, so. I just didn't feel like doing it because I knew I had to, because I knew I had to flat iron the whole fucking wig. Because as you can see, it's a kinky straight wig. And I had time for that. I'm trying to do big sections because I'm fucking tired. And I just started. I guess I should play some music to make me move faster, I guess. Okay, so. I finally finished the wig and the wig is big. I thought I was gonna wear this to work tomorrow. I think the fuck not. It's like, okay y'all, like from the side, maybe I'm overreacting. Maybe I just know that it's not cornrows up in here. So I'm like overdoing it. Like the wig big. Maybe I'm just telling myself that because I know I don't have cornrows up in here. From the side. Do it look like a lot of shit? Like it's like a lot going on back here. I'm gonna have to watch the video over and see, but I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna have to edit this video, send it over, and go to folks to bed. I don't know when the next time I'm gonna come on camera. Ava is fucking tired. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Damn. Picking up what naturally gets gripped into my hands, and that way I can stay down and close to the head all the way down to that nape area. This shit don't make no sense, bro. Like, as a wig influencer, how don't I know how to fucking corn roll? What, like, this is like fucking rock. This is rocket science. You keep on talking about under the middle. What the fuck? You gotta use some different terms, sir. I should try and attempt. It's starting to corn roll. I think I got it after that. I don't know. Hair be pulling. Then the corn roll be hurting. And then it don't be neat. 
didn't be taking me forever. I don't know, man. And I need my fucking hair corn rolled. Maybe I need to blow dry my hair and then try it. Because maybe my hair is too straight. Mm. Maybe that's... No, because my mama corn roll my hair when it's straight all the time. I don't know. And then I'm just crying because we're going to go outside. Hold on. I'm being a bad mom right now. I'm neglecting my child. Hold on. This is what we got so far. But these are the braids. They're a complete mess. I got on nails too, so it's kind of hard. But I learned something from the video. The man said keep your fingers straight the whole time. So that's what we're doing, huh? It's giving Medea goes to jail. Cause it's snowing. This I need to stop swinging them because they gonna come down. I'm talking about any kind. If all you need, just. Well, they got me. It's a kinky straight wig. Let me tell y'all something. Don't send no more kinky straight wigs. This is the second one of the goddamn wig. Thick ass wigs. They cute though. Or can I keep my fingers up, you baby? How won't you? As a girl who don't know how to cornrow, give me my props. Give me my props. I did, y'all. Proud of myself. Yeah, y'all already don't cop this ass up with that motherfucking car. I seen this little bitch that's on. Damn, bitch, I'm proud of you. Damn, bitch, I'm buying a bitch. Damn, bitch, I'm proud of you. 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 Yeah. That one, that one, I think we're gonna make it out the hood with that one. You get in the studio with that one? Yeah, we want to talk. Little baby, we want to do a song with you? Why? I'm fan. that's I know that's right. In the cut. We be vibing, smoking a black, and you know we be vibing. Will y'all judge me if I tell y'all I'm about to um go get into the biggie bag? Y'all won't judge me, right? Right? Y'all want to get into the biggie bag, y'all. I don't know what it is. No, for me to have did them cornrows, the, the flatness is eating just a little bit for me, to be honest. For me to have did them bogus ass cornrows earlier, the flatness, mm-mm. Yeah, but anyway, this is my third biggie bag. I, I don't think I recorded one biggie bag I had. My third biggie bag on this vlog. I think I had one off camera, but whatever. You know, tell that bitch Wendy she ate that little one when she created that piggy bag. Tell that little bitch with the red hair she ate that one. Look at my nails. I need to fill in so bad. Then I got them all up in the camera. Y'all, let me show y'all something. I called this nigga last night on some, like, on some drunk. Like, on some drunk, like, on some. Let me do a drunk call. Let me show y'all what this nigga said. <coughs> Don't. Bitch, don't laugh. <laughs> I ain't, that's what I get though, because I ain't had no business calling him. God was like, ah, nah, look at you, bitch. Sit your ass down. Hold on. Damn, I don't want to expose them, but then again, fuck them. Um, be nice. This bitch said, this bitch said, why is you calling me? Fuck on. Bitch, why would you say that to me? I'm never getting drunk in my life ever again. I don't know. It was the fuck on part for me. Wait, is it B? <laughs> Is it smoke? I'm never gonna drink again in my life. He ate me the fuck up. Why would you say that to me? Bounce away. Don't look different from earlier. Earlier I gave Cleo vibes. Getting out the car finna shoot at them cops. Now I'm giving a leer. <laughs> rock the boat. And my hair will be given. Rock the boat. Rock the boat. Change positions, Aaliyah. Beautiful, beautiful. Is your phone still on? Do not disturb. And um, stuff. Have you heard from Bobby? <sighs> um, she be calling and checking up on me and my relationship, child, because she know how I get. Not me just telling them about one man and then you bringing up another one. Okay, so he takes note. Why is you still talking about this one man, though?
Sunday. I'm about to go out and I'm about to um damn girl what you about to do oh we're about to go to the store but y'all trying to finish doing some house shopping when I finish I want to resume because I feel like I took a break from furnishing my house I feel like I got my bed my couch my tv then I was like done after that and it's like no girl you need to resume finishing furnishing your house like I take the longest furnishing house because first of all that shit ain't cheap all right let's talk about it and then what we're gonna do today we're gonna go to the store try to pick up a few items that I feel like I'm gonna like the main areas that I'm focused on is my kitchen and my bathroom right now I want to fully furnish an apartment that I'm not gonna stay in for more than a year I'll be doing one year and I'll be moving like I want to get somewhere and stay and then like deck it out fully because y'all know i don't play on material designer because <laughs> i feel like in the next six months i want to be moving i think i'm just gonna move to another unit like another apartment in my apartment complex but i feel like i don't know though for sure if i'm gonna move or not so it's like should i wait but it's like girl where is your apartment but it's like i don't know i don't want to get the hanging shit and making my apartment look like i'm staying for some years and i'm gonna take all this shit down like i don't know i don't want to I don't know if I want to really start damaging an apartment until I get somewhere that I'm going to be like there for a little minute. Like at least like, I need to at least try and stay somewhere for two years. I don't remember the last time I stayed somewhere for like over two years. I think it was 2022. In 2022, we had this one house. Me and my mom moved out of that house. We moved somewhere and I only stayed there for four months. Then I moved to my own apartment. I did a one year lease there and then I moved from there to here. Now in the next six months, I'm talking about moving from this apartment. So it's like, oh my God, like girl, sit the fuck down. But I'm, girl, I don't know. I gotta find that one apartment that I'm just set on and I'm a, like, I'm a just fully French out because I just feel like I be moving. I usually don't brag. I usually don't brag. But my skin is doing so much better, y'all. I don't know what happened, but when I made the transition between moving from St. Louis to Houston, when I got to Houston, I don't know if they got monkey pox in the air or fucking what but my face my face they they environment turned my face up like my face was terrible but something happened and now it's just it's clearing up as you can see my cheeks are still like really scarred up really bad so we don't turn to the side my forehead is back clear my nose my chin now all we gotta do up under my eyes is pretty fine. But all we gotta do is get them cheeks together. And we back in business. <laughs> oh, let me stop. I'm, I was just listening to my church music. Let me stop. We're not doing makeup. We're not doing makeup. I lied. Excuse me, Baba. I just wanna laminate my eyebrows. And then we can go. Put me some Carmex on and call it a day. Y'all, yeah, I wanna talk to y'all about something. I hate when I'm, you know, like I'm in a situation like this. Like, as y'all been seeing this whole week, well, last week, I don't know when this vlog was supposed to be. Last week, all of that mess with Nicki Minaj and Megan, I'm not the messy one here. I don't talk about celebrity beef because I mind my broke ass business. You know what I'm saying? So I don't, I don't mind rich people business. I'ma still buy my ticket for Pink Friday too, tour. I'ma still buy my ticket. But my heart is kind of turning from Nicki because uh, that was nasty. She acted so nasty last week. And usually, you know, she can't do no wrong in my eyes, but she was doing some wrong. I know how to separate people from their music. Oh, Nika Tanya and Nicki Minaj are two different people. I like Nicki Minaj. And Nika Tanya be tripping sometimes. So, at the end of the day, I gotta separate the two. So I got to go to that concert and hear that good music. But, you know, that was wrong, Nikki. So I'm already seeing stuff that I like, period, period. I know I want to do white and gold in my bathroom, but I just haven't found the right, you know. I think I'm going to do this with the clear tray. I think I like that. $10. Ooh, it's a red tag. Okay, I'm going to get that. I'm going to get there. Damn, somebody wrote some. I think I'm looking for a trash can. Oh my God, it's heavy. I need a 
bath mat for sure. Like a runner. Everybody keeps staring at me because I have a fucking camera in my hand. Let me tell you guys something. Get over it. I need a white one though. I know that's gonna get dirty so easy, especially because of denim. But I need a white one. It goes with my bathroom. And I gotta test it with my feet. I mean, it feels good, but I need it bigger. Ain't this cute? I'm gonna put this in the bathroom. Uh, I fuck with at home, cause they ain't have to do that. They ain't have to snap like that with that cup thing right there. Okay, we are at home. I tried to go to Marshall's, but it was inside of a mall and I ain't had time, so. Okay, so I found a different runner. I kinda like this one. Damn. Oh, my bitch is mad at me. Valet Park is on the district. I'm going straight to Gallery. Joe's feeling y'all. We finna call Shelly. Shelly better answer the phone. Uh, girl, answer the phone. So, guess what? What? Your fucking birthday is coming up. It's time to decorate dinner. Mm -hmm. What's your tail wagon for? You didn't pay for nothing. Move on away. It's a joke around here, bitch. It ain't shit funny. Oh, shit. I'm just leaving right there. Bitches, big zombies. Stay on straight. Y'all fuck with it. Okay, cool. Period. Cool. Oh, shit. How did they get dirty? Y'all see that fucking dirty thing? That one right there, and then that one right there. Oh my god. Let's try to do this in one try. I think I can do it. try and it's not crooked either don't play with me don't play with me <laughs> don't play with me <laughs> i got this from my kitchen i'm gonna work on my kitchen next after i finish my bathroom i'm gonna work on my kitchen 
But I haven't got this. This shit. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? Um, let me show y'all the bathroom before I go to the It gives. It gives. Um, yeah, this is what we came up with. Really cute. I'm going with gold and white in my bathroom. So my next thing is to get a gold um shower head and get some gold shelves and some gold rings. For my um what you call it um shower my shower uh curtain and stuff like that then i want to work on the kitchen <sighs> damn i got a headache i just took some ibuprofen i just got the shower i'm about to edit this hair video send it over real quick then start working on this video damn that sound like a lot of shit and i got a headache i'm ready to take these lashes off and hop my ashy ass in the bed. Cause why is my elbow? <laughs> I went live today and y'all was not fucking playing my ass. I was like, bitch, where the motherfucking vlog? Where the motherfucking vlog? Y'all been threatening me. It's just been a lot going on. Um, uh, I love y'all though. Thank you guys so much for watching and staying tuned this far. I really truly appreciate all the love and support. I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next weekly vlog. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe because you need to do that in order to keep me in these vlogs because honestly that's what motivates me yeah so all links to my social medias will be in the description box and your girl ever is out i love you guys so much denim loves you god love you more than the both of us keep god in your life fuck nigga i'll see you guys in the next video ever out